Good morning everybody. On Illuminator the Monk, I just wanted to show you before I started fighting that I'm going to get some upgrades. Found some upgrades on this fender. On these, where you see my mouse circling, this is what I'm currently wearing for my wrist piece. I got raw silk wristbands and for my ears, I have a mithril earring. It gives you nothing, no stats. So I'm going to replace it with this Electrum Amber earring. It gives me plus one strength, so that's just the only upgrade I get from it, but it is an upgrade. And then for the wrist slot, I'm going to replace this raw silk wristband that gives you two AC with an elect emerald electrum bracelet, which gives you three AC and plus four. But it also weighs only 0.1, and the one I'm wearing weighs 0.4. So very expensive upgrades for just a little bit of extra AC and strength. Here we go. Peridot. Nope. We want to buy the Electrum bracelet. Where is that one? Right there. 51 Platinum. We must do it. Also, a big shout out to Judo Kick. And there he is. And Pink Lotus. I was talking to Pink Lotus earlier. All right, guys. For the next upgrade I'm going to buy is going to be replacing this patch hide poncho that I'm wearing which has 4 AC, weighs 0.5. I'm going to replace it with this Kunzar Cloak, which has 7 AC, 2 Wisdom, 2 Intelligence. We don't care that much about that. It's got 10 Fire Resist, and it weighs 0.1. I'm going to spend 372 Platinum on it. Well, I'd say it's a beautiful day out in Field of Bone. We're heading over to the Servants of Synthrax right now. I'm 83% of the way into the level. I thought I would finish this level in the caves and then continuing leveling in the caves afterwards to see how much stronger we get once we level up. My goal is to be able to kill those things without a lot of downtime in between fights. Let's see if that happens. Currently I struggle with those guys. I kill one and I have to wait until my mend regenerates. I'd love to be able to kill two in between each mend. That would be a huge improvement and here we are first victim synthrax servant skeleton come here dude oh yeah that's right they're not aggressive totally forgot so i've mend ready we can see how much i struggle at the moment i was fighting in the giant for again i didn't want to record that though because it's just so much of the same old stuff There he does his little proc on me. He's winning, but we've got Mend Wound here. See how, this is how close the fights are at the moment. I'm really excited about getting those upgrades. The cape, the earring with plus one strength, and then the wrist piece that had an extra strength and it had 0.2 weight reduction from the previous item. And plus 10 res fire resist. Or, or plus 4 fire resist. The cape had plus 10 fire resist. So you can see I'm winning now. 66% to 31. So I can win these fights, but there's a lot of downtime in between, which is the problem. I'll fight two of these, and then I'll just finish leveling. And then I'll come back whenever I'm about to level. And then we'll see how much we progress to the next stage of level. Will we be able to kill two? Because currently I have to wait till Mend is active before I start the fight. I'd love to kill two every time I have Mend active. Meaning before it has to refresh again. So we killed it and I had 46% life left. Currently maxed out on the skills for this level course see you guys at the next fight okay i think i'm ready i've got mend ready to go and i've got 100 hit points there we go here he is he's got some uh, buddies over there standing up Let's see if i can get him here throw something at him and drag him oh no where'd he come from 
Are these still coming for me? Well, <laughs> there's one that passed, and I guess he just spawned. All right. Whoa, 59 damage. I think we'll be okay. I've got mend. Thank goodness for mend. So that is the weekend, and I'm off for the weekend. It's so amazing to have a weekend off. All right, let's use mend right now. Gosh, I only got him down to 89%. You see how much I struggle with these still. This isn't the usual roamer one. This is one that was in that room. I usually just fight the roamer. So I'm still using the Ixar Berserker Club. Haven't changed. I put it back on. I went, I went without for a while and tried to use Fist. Just to bump my AC a bit to see which is the preferred way to do it. I think the weapon's still better. But eventually I think if I didn't find any upgrades weapon wise, it would probably be okay to use Fist. Once my fist reach a higher level of damage. I have to look up on the wiki when that is. We get repost at level 35 and I'm currently level 32. So that's down the road. Next thing to look forward to. So he's got me down to 41% life on this one. And I can manage, but you can see how much downtime is in between fights. Quite a bit. They give a, the gold drops aren't that good. It's probably why not a lot of people will come down here. But let's see, my uh, bind wound is like 148. I go from 123 to 163, so about 40% or 40 hit points every time I use mend. Downtime ready. All right, we're back at it. Here, someone else came in here. I was away from keyboard. And someone else came in. Hopefully, they're not taking everything. But the Lord of Change only oh, has stop that. Can't play those videos. Here we go. Need some background music going. All right, he did 31 damage to me with that proc. This one is kind of easy. I'm going to fight a couple more after this. Flying solo. My apartment is a wreck. I have to start cleaning up. So, I'm Talking with my sister. We're making Thanksgiving plans. Neither of us are going to cook. Oh, pot mint. So we're looking at what kind of places are open around Thanksgiving. Um, probably purchase the food, of course, before Thanksgiving. I don't know how it works, to be honest. But neither of us want to cook. Neither of us have kids, so... It changes things a little. Oh, I have 68% life. Nice. I'm going to poke around here and see if anybody else was hanging out. Whoa, everything's dead. What the heck? Who's in here? Come on, guy. Well, there's one for me. Someone has killed many of them. The jesters, you have to watch out for. They will attack. There they are, those little jesters. And they... I tried to fight one one time, and I couldn't handle it. So it appears someone was in here, and I don't see him now. A guy named a reptile. He's level 35 necro. Maybe he left. But I'm going to chill out right here and wait for more of them and wait for my men to be reactivated. I uh, see a reptile with this corpse laying on the ground. Well, dang. Hope he doesn't take everything. He's level 35. I'm sure he could do a lot of damage in here. I'm level 32. Almost level 33 working at it. Okay, let's get this final kill to level up. There's this guy who came in here. He's a necro, same level as myself. And 
I am not quite ready, but Mend is active. I got 99% of my experience in the level, and this is going to be the kill that gets me the level. Before I start, let's get rid of all my copper. As you can see, I have 630 AC. We're going to see where I stand as far as AC gains after this next level. I'm going to keep deleting my copper so I can see how much AC I've improved. But let's go ahead and start this fight here. Close enough, 90%. I've lost one fight. Here we go. There's a chance I can lose this fight, but it's a small chance and I'm willing to take it. I'm about to hit, ah, uh, there we are to go mend. I only got him down to 86%, so this fight could go wrong. Hopefully not. I feel pressure to take fights a little sooner than I want to because other people have come in to, and really camping in the exact same spot as myself. When Necro was in here, he was level 35 and he left and then this guy showed up. When I was cleaning my apartment, I was feigned death on the ground and he just showed up. All right, this fight is almost even now, so it's not looking great. <clears throat> I might start trying to intimidation because it's so close. I'll do that after I get below 50% health, just so I can throw on a bandage while he runs around. But it looks like I might not need to. I'm starting to win again. Oh yeah, I should be fine now. This is it, level 33 ding coming up. Really excited. Damn, he's got me down to 36%. Alright, I'm going to do Intimidation just in case. It never works. It never works. Oh, yes. Okay, so let's start doing the... Start doing the, um... Bind Wound. Let's check it out. I have 628. Let's get rid of this copper. See how it took me up to 632? My actually, my AC increased a little bit because I think it's that innate, that innate AC, that XR skit. It went from 630 to 632. Throw in a couple more bandages and I'll be back when I'm ready to start the next fight. Let's do it. All right, this is gonna be the first fight since I've gained my level 33. some kind of sharp thing at him. Here we go. And offense is already going up. See, we're starting out with 632 AC. I'm not going to collect coins while I'm increasing my defense. Because I want to see my AC gain per level. Just putting that out there. Whoa, took a massive amount of damage. Just throw up and end. So I'm watching... A series called Sopranos and I've never seen this show I see lots of clips on YouTube but I've never actually watched so I bought season one just to see if I'd enjoy it for this weekend I'll be watching it in between recording when I'm have downtime and resting I'm on the pilot episode now and it seems to be pretty good so if you guys know anything about Sopranos and Maybe talking about the show for the next few videos at least. If I enjoy it. People say I'm in for a treat. Alright, I am doing so much better now on this thing. Look at this. I'm up to 76% life and he's almost dead. I mean, some of these are lower levels than others. But the goal was to be able to fight these with less downtime. Let's see. Will this still give me up to 3% of my experience? I'm at 1% now. Yeah, it still gives me 2%. And you see, like, I'm almost ready to fight again. There's the other guy. Let's check him out. He's blue to me now. He was white earlier. So I didn't gain any defense yet. That's okay. All right. Let's do another one. Hopefully we're getting better. That's the point. Are we getting stronger? Am I able to take these out maybe two instead of one at a time between mend? 
I need to fight two so we can start increasing my leveling rate. Get ourselves towards level 35 where we get repost. And also, when I can start getting into areas like Crypts of Dalnir and not die, I need upgrades. I need to get a character. I need to get him in his 40s. I need to get some characters higher than, you know, they start getting bogged down in the 20s and 30s, and it's usually because I'm. My gear's not carrying me through it very well. Okay, so. Not doing too well. Let's hit mend. Back up to 88%. That's fine. Double kick, or double attack, and then where's flying kick? Flying kick is 167. All right, if we're not doing massive amounts of damage, it's still pretty much the same. I think we're, um, there he goes, defense went up. That's what I wanted to see. We went up from 632 to 635. Let's get rid of this silver. I'm trying to get a good estimation of how much AC I'm increasing. That's why I'm deleting it. All right, let's start throwing Intimidation so I can increase this skill as well. I don't care if it works or not. That guy's been chilling there for a while. So, you know, this thing's got me down to 49%. So it's not an amazing progression since I hit this level. I did resist that Ice Bone Frost spell, though. All right. Hmm, see, I have to bandage up actually. Let's check it out, AC 635, yeah. Cause I'm picking up the silver and you just stop picking up. Coins, 635, that's good. Throw one more bind wound up. Double attack, double attack, hand to hand, all these going up, flying kick, dodge, defense, one handed blunt, block, like it, like it. All right, let's just see if, well, this guy hasn't respawned, you know, the one that I usually fight. He still has respawned, so. And the other guy left, so. Let's see if I can fight this guy by himself, way in this corner here. And not gather attention from anybody else. Damn it. I hate when that happens. Okay, all right, not doing too well yet. I already use a mint. No skill gains yet. Okay, things are looking good. <laughs> that laugh. Damn. I feel like I've... Some of these, I feel like some of them are stronger. And some of them are weaker. It just all can't account for RNG. Sometimes they're obviously weaker than others. So there's a level range on these guys, but they all consider blue. Ow, oh, man, it's got me down half life. Why am I, oh, oh, I have to scroll up, there we go. I was gonna say, why am I not getting any skills? Sweet, so 4% experience in this level. Let's see where we go up to. Probably six. Yep, six. And then if I can do this really quick, bind wounds. I don't think I can um, take two in between mends. Like like when, like for every kill I do, I have to have mend, use mend once. I was hoping it wouldn't be that way, but I don't know. Defense isn't, defense has only gone up one time, I think. Defense plays a big role. See, I'm trying to find out how many times defense went up. Uh, by intimidation. Okay, here we go. So there's where we gained a level. And defense is at 161 there. Okay. Yeah, so it's only gone up one point. So it can still go up four more points. That's going to make a big difference. Last bind wound, and then I'm going to go take a chill and come back. And Actually, I'm going to go fix some lunch, and then... 
Hopefully nobody comes in here and starts killing things, but I would like to fight a Jester as soon as my defense maxes out. Go fight one of those Jesters. I've never killed a Jester yet. I don't think there's anything important about him, but that'd be significant if I can kill a Jester when I couldn't before. We'll find out. Well, I've been down here fighting for a while. Nothing major's going on, really. Um, you know, I'm doing better, but I thought I'd be doing much better than I'm doing. Almost 20% through this level now. I try to fight some jesters and they kicked my butt, so... I'm back to just fighting these guys one at a time. Nothing's changed, really. I guess one level hasn't made that much of a difference. I can go to another location, but uh, I don't know. Just this is a real nice camp because I can uh, I can just do things in between spawns, and I just kill one at a time. So it's just gonna be a slow grind all the way to level thirty-four. I was thinking maybe I should research on where to go to get some upgrades. Somebody's mentioned before. But I can't remember. It was so long ago. I'm going to upload this video in about an hour. So what I'd like to do is if anybody watches it this far, give me some ideas on where I can go to get some upgrades or just a new place to level. I'm open to going to um, anywhere in the game. I'll have to run there. But oh no, I'm after. There are two of them. Oh no, that's just feign death. See ya. So give me some ideas. Should I go to... Mm, should I go to Mistmore Castle? Should I go to... Soul A? Should I go to... Unrest and try to fight... Um, inside the building... Maybe get some Dwarven work boots or something like that. I can't remember what level range I'm good for. So, again, I'm level 33. Where could I go? Solo. Remember, I'm solo self-found. i got to be able to solo where we go. Looking for ideas, everyone. So I'm going to do one more kill, and then I'm just going to upload this video. We did ding. Level 20, level 33. And um, I gotta be able to get back by level 35. Because I wanna get repost. But I need some upgrades. Like, I want a weapon upgrade really bad. This is what I'm using XR Berserker Club, 7 damage, 18 delay. And I can. I really need some replacement for my pants. I'm wearing these that weigh 3 stone. Carry on beetle leggings. I got those in the newbie yard in Field of Bone. These rust boots are okay. Um, I can start working on this Shackle of Stone quest probably in one or two levels. I'll finish that one. Very nigh mask. That's okay. I like that one. And then loose fighting sleeves. Yeah. So these are great because they also give you like a light source. So, with those, I probably don't need this Greater Light Stone. I don't know. Where do you guys think I should go fight? That's the question. Alright, ready to do my last kill. I'm trying to work at my sneak as well. Alright, here we go. Let's kick his butt. He knows he can't handle me. Oops. Yeah, The Sopranos is actually a really good show. I've only watched the first episode, the pilot episode. Oops, I just hit mend. There we go. Oh, that's loud. Let's 
spooky music. Oh, I'm doing my Walmart shopping. I was going to order from Howard E.E. Butts, H-E-B, but I decided to order from Walmart because they have cheaper delivery and it's quicker. There's these cakes I like to get. They're cherry cordial flavored snack cakes, like in the little Debbie aisle. They're really good. I, I like, they only sell them around Christmas time, holiday stuff. And I love them. They're so good. I'm going to get some. Besides that, I need to get some um, drinks. Got to get low on water. I buy water these days. Um, what else do I need? Need some toothpaste. What else could I use? I was looking at snacks. Because it's going to be movie night. I'm going to watch Sopranos. Oh, down, down to 15, 12, down to 12%, down to 10%. Come on, die. Down to 10%. Yeah, so I'm going to watch Sopranos season one. Try to watch it tonight or between tonight and tomorrow. tomorrow. And next week is going to be a three-day week. And then I'm going to have a four-day weekend. Thank God. I'm going to have a four-day weekend. So I'm going to play a lot of AirQuest. I'm going to watch a lot of Sopranos. So I'm going to upload this video. And um, yeah, I'm uploading it today. And I'm... Uploading it about an hour after I'm playing. So see you guys soon. And then I'll get on and make some more videos later on today. After I watch an episode or two of Sopranos. See you soon. Bye.